So I just see you um, working on the, the shoulder bump with Jim. Is a, is a shoulder bump easy to avoid when you're in that close range? Uh, it depends on the, how quick you put in and how you're going to use it. If I attack you, yeah, and then you yeah, yeah, so it's not going to be that effective for you, for instance. Yeah. yeah? Maybe effective for a uh, different person. So as soon as you're coming in and then you go like that, show the bump, my hand is already in line here to su support that. Okay, so this is where I come in here to control the light, me coming in here to do the work. Right. So all this movement here is all dependent again on to how you're using that shoulder pump. Yeah, if you're punching me and if you do that to say shoulder in there, that's when I come back here. Okay. Yeah, again I go back to where your position again. Yeah, yeah. 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 that's exactly what's happening. Down, down, yeah. Down, down, yeah, so all the time on this movement, it go back to maybe I hit, yeah, then attack, you show the pump, you undercut my hand. Yeah, you go round me, then we go back to where we start again. Yeah, all the same stuff. All the same movement, basic training that you're in all the time. Okay? Yeah. And to I guess if I don't know what the hell I'm doing, then that's really it. You're the shoulder bump, there's no point. There, there is no point. Yeah, you cannot put that in to make it work, or you cannot try to, to, to do that. Yeah. yeah, a lot of times someone hit, you go to shoulder bump, I'm here already. I might quickly turn here, now I'll be in this position. Mm -hmm. Neck, choke on you, already here. Yeah, so no. Not of depend. It depends how that movement uh, come along, yeah? yeah? That movement that come along. If your shoulder coming here from here, for instance, see? It's all depend how that come along for that. If that come in straight away here, yeah? yeah? And then you come along here, yeah? It's all depend. And depend how you hold your hand. Yeah, of course. Yeah? So a lot of time when I attack like that, your shoulder here, and then my hand too straight, that's it. Yeah. Now you can go with shoulder bump. Yeah. Now, yeah. boom, that's it. But, when you come in to do the line here, boom, boom, yeah, shoulder come, 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 behind the shoulder, but me, I'm here, and I had it like this, yeah, you can't do anything, yeah, then you got a problem, then I can be, go back to the again, go back to this block on you again, yeah, and then that's it, we've done the business here, go back to the movement where we start again, <laughs> it's all go back to the same principle on the movement, how you respond, how you react, how much energy you, uh, through you learn to, res to feel the person, to know where they are. So ultimately, are you good enough to outsmart your body? Exactly. Are you spending enough time yeah. grinding and doing the training to become good and perfect your movement? Yeah. So it's your, your natural response. Not natural your response. Yeah, yeah. Then, not about you've got the best technique, it's how good you respond to the threat. Yeah, yeah. yeah? Do you do that with your left That's it. Or that's yeah. what I'll go back again. Uh, fight or fly syndrome. Yeah, yeah. You either fight, get on with it and do what you've been learning to, to put it across. Or you just fly away, but you, you, you can't do it. Yeah. Is that answer question here? Yeah, it's good. So instinct. Yeah. Instinct. Cool. Instinct is the key. It's like anything in the world you do. If you think you see somebody very beautiful, the instinct going after her, then of course you're going to do it. If you've got instinct going says you're too good for me, then go home and find an ugly one, then maybe that's your choice. Is that answer question for you?